What's up, YouTube? This is Lord Potato Llama Gaming, and I am back with a brand new episode of Poke MMO with Buffin Guest, aka Pokemon Fan Fiction Novels. Hey, everybody. Let's go ahead and talk to Captain Stern here. Oh, yeah, because they steal the submarine. Right. Which, you know, they could have done anyway if they just let him get along with his parts. Mm. I know, I'm still... I'm still annoyed about that. You know, that's such a big plot hole. You know, if we, if we just let that that grunt get away with stealing the parts in the first place, this would have only prolonged Archie's evil plan. As soon as he asks why, he, he jumps immediately to the first and obvious reason that they do it. Right. So, they can't be doing the only thing that they'd actually be doing with it. So, the Lepa Berry. I'm surprised how much berries sell for. That's nice. Yeah, by all means, sell your nuggets and your untradeable items, but... You know, you find something that you can put online, do it. Uh, by the way, did you uh, get rest from this guy's house who he was sleeping? I'm not near awake enough yet. Here, you could have this. So it's like, I wait till this guy is half asleep, and then I come in, hey, give me stuff. And he, he doesn't realize, oh, uh, somebody in my house, and just half asleep, can't be arsed right now. Here, take it and leave. Yeah. Can I also just say that I thought Mighty Anna was the coolest thing for so long when I got Emerald, and now I see it as the trash that it really is? I thought the same. You know, as soon as I saw, it has an Intimidate ability, an ability that worked every single battle. I thought that was so cool, and then I saw, oh, Salamence gets Intimidate. Ah, she got me! Now, remind me, the next time we see Archie, I'll do the voice. God, why? What? What happened? Every time I get badly poisoned. I, I pretty much never get poisoned, so, you know, here, have these. I still have one left, so... There, have a dollar. <laughs> yeah, so... Like, the one directly in front of you, besides this one, is also an electrode, so... Wow. Okay, I, I can't believe he lived through that. Same. So just get the two get, get the two on the left. Alright. I have to. This time we're not going to use a physical move, though. We're going to use a special move and see if that kills it in one hit. I don't think it will. Um, half health, I'm guessing. Half health? Oh, wow! <laughs> I was way off! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry if this day's uh, commentary is kind of dull, guys. We just don't have much to say. There's not a whole lot you can say when you're fighting one grunt after the next after the next. <laughs> so much better. I'd actually have more to say about this area, but, like, I've said this on my own run, so it's just... A lot of the stuff I say repeats at this point. So I'm going to pose a question to, I guess, you and your audience, since we're, we've been fighting all these teams and stuff. Let's say, for sake of argument, the Pokemon world is real, and for one reason or another, you are now a grunt on one of the teams. Two questions. Question one, which team are you on, and why? And question two, okay, I guess it's three questions now, isn't it? Uh, yeah. What Pokemon do you have, realistically speaking? Like, they, they can't be very good because you're a grunt, but... You know, I've seen grunts with pretty decent Pokemon. If I were on an evil team, I'd be on Team Rocket, for sure. Okay. Because that that crime organization just does not die. Um, I'd probably have a Rhyhorn that never evolves. Golbat. I'd say we own I'd say like maybe three or four Pokemon and that's it. Dog Trio, which I um basically stole from Diglett's cave. I'd have Eradicate. If I were my own crime boss, I would have a far different team. Something that an uppity 10-year-old couldn't beat in, like, two minutes. Also, I have something to ask you. This is, like, going into, um, the fandom kind of deep. Let's say, for the sake of argument, you, in the anime, had a battle bond with your Pokémon. Mm -hmm. What Pokémon would it be, and what would the battle bond do? I mean, I guess my answer is the same as it would be with Mega Evolution. Absolutely Steelix. Ooh. I mean, Mega Steelix just looks so freaking cool. Yeah, getting a Mega Steelix in that universe, that would pretty much terrify anybody. I don't care what Pokemon you have. Mega Surprise, bitch! <laughs> he has a giraffe rig. Eh. Oh my god, Echo just ate a psychic type move. That is hilarious. Oh okay, my god, he talked. Down. This guy talked out his ass! He was talking to me and he was turning the he was turned the opposite direction. Also, I'm not looking forward to this battle. Oh, the double battle. Oh yeah, yeah it's gonna be. It is going to be uh, a new experience. 
Uh, I'll tell you that much. Yeah, I remember it's not fun. I lost so many mons in my emerald lock going through it. Because fairy types don't exist, so that means it's not resistant to leech life. Okay. See, I don't... I don't mind the fairy type. I just why didn't they give us a light type to go with the dark types? I I can't get over that. I don't know. Maybe the light type is fairy type. Then the dark type should be called something else. It should be called I don't know, demon type, I, I guess. Oh my god, now this old woman is talking out her ass. Why? I'ma suck you dry, kid. I'ma take all of your health. Then I'll give you a five across the ass! My plan right now, if I assume they still only have Lunatone and Soul Rock, or do they have more? Oh, they have more. They have them, but they've got more than them. I'll, yeah, I'll yeah, go I'm gonna first. watch your battle. Yep. All right. This combination, can you beat it? Okay, this is not good at all. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Mm. Nice. Oh. All Very right. Very good. How much can you eat now? Oh, damn. Will yeah! It probably will be. Yep. Ah. Uh, yep, there we go. There we go. Alright. This would be so hard if you weren't, like, you know, doing two other regions besides this right now. That is true. Yes! Okay. It's gonna use Ice Beam and kill uh, Weed Ninja, I know, but... Yep, there's the <laughs> Ice Beam. Oh, you lived through it. Oh my god! Freaking Weed Ninja, pull through, my boy! That feels good, man. Ugh! First try. Haven't died once. Okay, Surf and uh, Shadow Ball on whatever poor sap comes out. Oh, wow, yeah. they didn't heal. Okay, then. Come ha on, Meter Mash. Bop! God. Yeah! All right, guys, I think we're going to call that an episode if I can get my earbud back in my ear. There we go. So... Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed today's episode, don't forget to hit that like button. Don't forget to check out Buffin's channel. You guys are amazing. You should feel amazing. Thank you guys yet again for watching. This is a dream come true for me. You make it all possible. And we will see you in the next episode. Goodbye!